Hello, it's Aleš from European Coffee Trip and I would like to welcome you in a series of videos we created with our partner from DR Wakefield. DR Wakefield is a coffee trading company based in London that has been in the coffee industry for almost 50 years. Their team has tremendous knowledge and skills in coffee that we ask them to share on a camera. In this video, Diana will explain the process of green coffee grading and what parameters does she evaluate in coffee. <laughs> So the first thing I do is I'm going to take the moisture content because I need to understand if the moisture content is within the range that is acceptable. That range that we want is around 9 or 10 percent up until 12 percent and the density. Density can be used by roasters to understand how to write their curves or uh, what they can expect within the roasting process. And the moisture content, if it's out of that range, it's going to be difficult to roast in various ways depending on if it's too high or too low. Um, and you're also not going to have as much consistency and you can predict some issues with the drying process back at origin. I will then proceed on to the screen grading. I will take a sample of that coffee and I'll shake it through these kind of screens basically that allow only the beans that are smaller than that size to fall through it. So as long as there's 95% of that size, then that coffee passes the screen grading test. And then the next thing I'll do is I'll take a 350 gram sample. I'll uh, lay that out on a black mat. And what I'm searching for is defects. This allows me to understand A, the grade of the coffee, but B, to compare it to what is expected from origin or what we've agreed on. And that's uh, actually quality control for not just us, not just the origin, but also for the roaster, because obviously what we are sending them there dependent on making sure that we are also looking after these things. Similarly, origin needs to know what's landing. We hope that you enjoyed this video. If you would like to learn more about DR Wakefield and their projects, so check out their website, drwakefield.com. And don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel. And I would like to thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Bye bye.